Alexander, this is Bob Mason from FX Empire, and welcome to the Daily Crypto Tech Review of Bitcoin, Ethereum, Litecoin, and Ripple's XRP. We're looking at the MACDs, the moving averages, the day's support, resistance, and pivot levels, and the Fibonacci's. It is Tuesday, the 26th of October. Looking at Bitcoin against US dollar, it's been a mixed start to the day. Going to need to see Bitcoin avoid the pivot at 42,466 to take a run at the first major resistance level at 64,300. Plenty of support from the broader market will be needed for Bitcoin to break out from yesterday's high, it was at 43,666. So barring an extended rally on the day, expect that first major resistance level to cap the upside. In the event of an extended rally, you should see Bitcoin target the second major resistance level at 65,500 before any pullback. A fall through the pivot will bring the first major support level at 61,266 into play. Barring an extended sell-off on the day, Bitcoin should stay clear of sub-60 levels. Second major support level sits at 59. 432. Looking at the MACD's widening of the bearish histograms at the turn of the day, coming off the back of this morning's pullback, so keep an eye out for direction there. On the MAs, bullish signal, however, after yesterday's bullish crosses, so a widening of the 50 from the 100 and the 200, suggesting further upside ahead. So key would be to avoid the pivot at 62466 and break through yesterday's high 63666 to bring resistance levels into play. Moving across to Ethereum against US dollar, positive start to the day. Going into Ethereum, avoid the pivot at 4176 to take a run at the first major resistance level at 4282. Support from the broader market is going to be needed for Ethereum to break out from this morning's high, 4257.71. So, barring an extended rally on the day, expect that first major resistance level and resistance at 4300 to cap the upside. In the event of an extended rally, got Ethereum's all time high, 4383.4 to cap the upside on the day. Second major resistance level, that's at 4343. Fall through the pivot will bring the first major support level at 4115 into play. Barring and extend the sell on the day, Ethereum should still well clear sub 4000s. Second major support level, 4008, should limit the downside. Looking at the MACDs, slight widening of the bullish histograms at the turn of the day, but really nothing to suggest direction, so keep an eye out there. On the EMAs, that is a bullish signal, however, 50 pulling away from the 100 and the 200, suggesting further upside ahead. So key, avoid the pivot at 4176, break through the morning high, 4257.71, to then bring resistance levels into play. Looking at Litecoin against US dollar, mixed start to the day, going to need to see Litecoin avoid the pivot at 194, to take a run at the first major resistance level at 199. Support will be needed to break out from yesterday's high, 197.36. So barring an extended rally on the day, expect that first major resistance level and resistance at 200 to cap the upside. In the event of an extended rally, you should see Litecoin target 205s before any pullback. Second major resistance level sits at 202. Fall through the pivot will bring the first major support level at 191 into play. Barring an extended sell on the day, Litecoin should stay clear of sub 185s. Second major support level at 186 should limit the downside. Looking at the MACDs, narrowing of the bearish histograms at the turn of the day, but inconclusive. So keep an eye out for a possible bullish cross there. On the EMAs, 50 has converged on the 100. So looking out for a bullish cross to support further upside ahead. So key, avoid the pivot at 194. Break out from yesterday's high, 197.36, to bring resistance levels into play. Finally, looking at Ripple's XRP against US dollar, bullish start to the day. Going to see Ripple's XRP avoid the pivot. At 1.0923, to take a run at the first major resistance level at 1.1062. Support will be needed for Ripple's XRP to break out from yesterday's high, 1.103. So barring an extended rally on the day, that first major resistance level should cap the upside. In the event of a breakout, got resistance at 1.15 to cap the upside on the day. Second major resistance level sits at 1.1170. Fall through the pivot would bring the first major support level at 1.0815 into play. Barring an extended sell on the day, Ripple's XRP should avoid sub 0.107 levels. Got 38.2% fib at 1.0659 and the second major support level at 1.0675. Looking at the MACD's bullish cross at the turn of the day. So keep an eye out for a widening of bullish histograms through the morning. On the MAs, 50 is closing in on the 100 and the 200. So also look out for a possible bullish cross 50 through the 100. That would support further upside on the day. So key would be to avoid the pivot 1.0923, break through yesterday's high 1.103 to bring resistance levels into play.